Hey there, Higsby. Glad to hear the powerhouse pair's back in action. Sorry I got upset. This is to apologize. Huh. Thus we get Quake 2W, Tree Bomb 1 Asterisk, and Sonic Wave Eye. Very nice. Well, I'm off. Huh. <laughs> hey, hey, that funky Electopian's over there. Bet some funk's about to go down. <laughs> oh, now I'm just imagining Higsby decked out like a ninja or a costumed henshin type superhero. Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> so let's check in with our source of information here. Ahem. I'll look for the stolen passport and battle chip. Ahem. Jim, who lives on a back street, knows about that stuff. So, according to him, we need to go check out the alleyway. We must find Jim. This ain't a tourist attraction. Beat it. Oh, well, they're nice and friendly here. Between the trash, a rat is snacking on some food. But once we scare him away, it reveals a slightly dirty reg up too. But it installs just fine. Am I Jim? Why do I gotta tell you my name, huh? Hmm? Gramps sent you? Lost your passport and chips? If Gramps sent you, I guess I'll help, but it'll cost you. Bring me that rare Electopian chip guard asterisk. Really? That's rare? Okay, as, sure, as soon as I have one again. <laughs> Alright, I'll tell you about your passport first. By now it's out of our world and in the cyber world. Jack your Navi in and search for the thief on the net. To jack in, though, you need Raoul's permission. He runs the show. Tell him I sent you. If your passports reach the internet, you'll never find it. You better hurry. So now we need to go talk to Raoul. Yes, I'm Raoul. Ah, Jim sent you. Alright, but I don't help weaklings. If you can beat my Thunderman, you can jack into my radio. If you're strong enough to win, you can handle the rest. Sound fair? Ah, sure, why not? The pride of my clan will lead me to victory. Meet Thunderman. He's rather annoying, if only for the fact that... The way he attacks, close-range attacks like swords will not help. He always stays on the back column. So, yeah, let's open up some new possibilities here. His cloud obstacles also have a nasty habit of getting right in the way. He can summon ball lightning from them, and if you try to impede their progress, they'll try to stab at you with a cross-shaped blast of lightning. So, yes, very problematic, that. Okay, um... Oh, yeah, I can't use the invisible with that. Right. Okay, fine then. I'll just go invisible now. Oh, bugger. He can also call down lightning on your side of the field, as just demonstrated. M-N-O-P-Q. Program Advance Mega Burst! Oh, still not enough. How much health you got left over there? 100. Excellent. Airmen, save me. Take us home. Yeah, Thunderman gets fairly frantic. And we get 500 zenny for the battle. This proves that you are indeed the victor. Very well. Access the net. We get the Raoul code. Could it be an Electopian Samurai? <laughs> okay, so Higsby's a superhero and lands a Samurai. I can accept that. So let's get into the radio then. <laughs> I kind of like the background here for some reason. Okay. <laughs> oh look, we have the satellite. Uh, the uh, the Remo bit virus is back again. But we need not worry of that. And hey, we get a row of it one. Nice. Another Navi plus 20. Those can come in fairly handy sometimes. Okay, this time you're going to blow me back. But you know, really, the only thing here I'm truly worried about is that Sparky virus. So sing, Toadman. Amusingly, even if blown back, your <laughs> flamethrower stays where it should be. So that's kind of funny.
Okay, continuing on our way. We get another bug frag. I can accept that. Oh, come on, let me out of here. Again, I'm only worried about the satellite virus. I do not want to have to dodge that thing while I'm also having to worry about the fan viruses. Okay. Let's go ahead and get rid of you. And now I can just wait. Go away. Okay, now I'm on the actual Natopian network. You came here to look for your passport? Someone in NetSquare might know something about it. So that's our next destination. This is a highly complicated area, too. The net square is up the slope. So let's just continue on for now. Oh my, we have more advanced B tanks. So yes, now they're up to using cross bombs, I believe. Oh, not fast enough. There we go. Cross bomb J get. Nice. Inside we have a net dealer, and to the left the net square. So let's go ahead and check out the dealer first. I'm a net dealer. Wanna take a look? Hmm. You have a couple of rather promising chips here. I will definitely take those. Oh, and we have ratty viruses again. Surrender to me your little mousy chips. Rat on 1H. Oddly, these particular slopes don't seem to have any bug frags behind them. Oh well. Okay, Field of Metars. Gut Punch, Cold Punch, Dash Attack, why not? Mega Punch! So that was rather fun. Whoa, hi there, Number Man. I'm a traveling Number Man. Want to see my wares? Yes, Number Man is basically just a shop in this particular game. As long as he's here, I may as well buy each of his chips. Take advantage of him while they're there. And hey, <laughs> I got a return on my investment. Nice. So, welcome to the Net Square in Netopia. This is the Net Square entrance. Netopian programs talk like this. Just kidding. <laughs> nice. I saw a thug Navi leaving the square. I heard him saying that he's busy and has a meeting. And we have another net dealer. And he has a power-up for us. I will definitely take that, thank you. So, let's power up. Even with tight security, bad guys still pop up. Are you looking for your passport? I think I saw a thug Navi with a passport. I believe that's everything we need to know. So, time to head back out onto the net. Through this way to get to another part of the Netopian network. 